Hey man, what's good y'all man? Look, today I'm finna show y'all how to beat the God Free Spirit. And shit, so look, all you need is the Black Flame and the God Slayer set, which I'm gonna show you how to get at the end of the video. But look, you could do use any like range weapon if you want to, but all you need to do is range and just dodge. Cause like when you're at a far range, the only move he's really gonna do is that move right there, which is easy to dodge. You mainly gonna like move side, like you gonna like move around him. Like when he, he zooms in, he does that, you wanna be moving to the side of him and then dodge his sweep. I mean his uh stomp. Whenever he whenever you dodge the swamp, the stomp, I mean, you're gonna dodge again because he's gonna swing again. And sometimes he might swing a, another time. So just look, dodge that, dodge that, and then just keep on throwing it. That's his that's his next one. I, I forgot to dodge that one, but every single time. And as you can see, the thing the difference between normal flame and black flame. Is the black flame lasts longer and it, it takes off so much more. So once you upgrade the seal, uh, this is like a faith. This is a pure faith build. Uh, it's like a level 70, I think. So I don't know. I don't know if that's over leveled. I don't think it is for fighting this guy. But uh, if you you just need a range thing, dodge his. Just stay, keep your distance from him. Dodge his little stomp. And then it's real simple after you learn how to uh, learn what time, the time and his stomp and then his moves after. And you just keep on running away. Keep on throwing stuff at him. You know what I'm saying? And it's easy after that. But yeah, I'm finna show you how to uh, how to get the Black Flame, the God Slayer seal. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I bet. So look, to get it, you need to go to Stormvale Castle. It's at the left side chamber, however you say it. <clears throat> I mean, you're gonna need a um, you're gonna need a a key. You're gonna need a stone sword key. You're just gonna run out here by this uh, by these dogs and this big fat nigga. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna run over here where this this imp statue or whatever is at. And when you get there, you're gonna have to use your key, and it's gonna be two chests up in there. You open both of them. One of them's gonna have the. Uh, it's gonna be a prayer book, a God, a God Slayer prayer book, um, and the other one's gonna be the God Slayer seal. And that's really that's really all you need. And after you uh, after you get it from in here, you just upgrade your seal and stuff. Um, yeah, you know what I'm saying. I probably got like a 35 faith, so it's. And the God Slayer seal also it boosts your God Slayer uh, things, but um, you want to go to the table like like go to anybody who you can give the prayer book to so that you can buy the flame, uh, the flame throw. And but yeah, the Slayer seal uh, it's 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 what's it called? Uh, it boosts your God Slayer um, magic incantations, and it's it's a. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Like it, it, it's real. It's real powerful to higher your faith. My faith is like a 40 actually. So the higher your faith is, the scaling is super high on faith. So when you super, when you upgrade it a lot, I mean you don't have to use the God Slayer seal if you don't want to. If you got the other seal maxed out, but I use the God Slayer seal and stuff to beat them. So uh, yeah, that's how you beat. That's how you beat God free the spirit. I ain't get to God free yet. I beat him on my other player, but not on this one yet. But yeah, man, y'all hit that like button, subscribe to my post notifications. And I'm out, man. Peace.